first family has a ball hosting congressional picnic, but two very special guests get the royal treatment President Donald Trump and the first family took a break from politics to celebrate on Thursday, but the president didn't forget about two special guests who have been suffering. The family attended its first congressional picnic and had a great time on the White House South Lawn, which was decorated to look like New York City's Central Park, the Daily Mail reported. The Trumps had a ball, with First Lady Melania Trump kissing babies and mingling with guests, while Ivanka Trump played with her daughter, Arabella Kushner, in the Rose Garden, the president spoke to the attendees briefly and made sure to mention his thoughts and prayers were with Representative Steve Scalise who was injured in an assassination attempt by a former Bernie Sanders volunteer. President Trump has kept in close contact with his friend Scalise and his progress since the shooting and sat with him bedside in the hospital while he was still in critical condition. Scalise and his family are pictured below as prayers across the country, went out to him and his recovery, Trump made sure to give Scalise's two children special treatment at the picnic for all they've been through. We are so touched that joining us here this evening are Steve and Jennifer's children, the president said. In fact, we just gave them a beautiful tour of the White House. They got the A tour. We gave them the A tour. And I want them to know the whole country is praying for their courageous dad. President Trump said he wanted to attend the congressional baseball game that Representative Scalise was practicing for when he was shot but was advised not to go. I wanted to be there so badly you have no idea, but our folks from the Secret Service said maybe we should take a pass, he told attendees. He continued to call for unity between the parties following the tragedy. It's our hope that the unity showed that evening can continue to grow and thrive between Republicans and Democrats, the president said. I think we'd be doing a lot better, and I know the country would be doing a lot better. We will prove worthy of the trust the country has placed in us. I am hopeful the spirit of cooperation we have seen in recent days 